Hello guys, welcome back and in today's video we're gonna go check what to buy in Reverse 1999. If you are a spender, let's say you're not a whale, because if you're a whale just buy everything, right? If you are not a whale and you want to spend a little bit, or at some point you feel like you want to spend to support the game, which is completely understandable, I myself, I will try to buy the, the Roaring Month. And there is a ma there's many options for you if you want to spend a little bit of money. And depending on how much you want to spend, we can check and check all the options and analyze which options are the best and which op option and which order you should buy stuff, right? So, first of all, let's go check on... Okay, this is the shop. It's going to look like this. It's going to be the rookie pack. It's going to be the subscription. It's going to be across the starry sky, which is basically like a bunch of stuff that you can buy. And like a, like a rundown of what you can buy. Those are skins that you can buy. And this is the probably extra stuff that you can buy for the wilderness. Now, on the, the first... The first tick here on the first section is called the Teller Machine. I don't know how it's gonna call it's gonna be called in English on the on the English uh, client, but those are the juicy ones. Those are the juicy juicy options for any spender. Any spender. If you're a well, just buy everything that you see. So that's fine. Now, if you want to spend a little bit, the good part, the good options are this: the Rookie Shopping Day. It's one, uh, this is going to be in yen, but I'm going to try to like do a little estimate on uh, on the price in dollars. This is going to be one dollar, more or less. You, you get one dollar, you get one pool, 10k Sharpodonti, 10k Dust, and one free Bunny Bunny, right? So free four, car four star character, which is pretty decent for a free character, right? So that's a good one. On the Roaring Month, this is the classic monthly subscription you do you pay um, around four dollars more or less and you will get 300 special uh paid crystal okay uh, clear, clear drops the the paid ones they're pur they're purple you can see and once a day for the uh, for the rest of the month so for a total of 2.7 k 2700 crystal drops delivered to you every day 90 per day and on top of that which is a, which make which makes it a little bit better than the other games as well so this is really good also gives you a total of like 1.8 thousand uh stamina refill this is a stamina refill this one gives you 60 so it's going to give you a lot of free stamina for the first month which is going to be crucial since we are we are we're new players so we're going to need a lot of stamina to farm materials right materials right so this is the probably the best choice for everybody even if you're free to play you can be free to play plus and just buy this once just for a little help and then move on right on top of those so those are the first two that come to mind i don't know if these are going to be the same so i'm not going to touch them they're probably going to be here as well but the ones that are going to be there for sure are the initial summon package, the rookie offer, and the offer of the month. Now, the rookie offer is about 10 euros, I believe. It's about 10 euros, and you get some uh, box for sele selection of um, insight materials that you can uh, of your choice if you want to level up someone. So this is really good for leveling up, uh, boost on leveling up for a character. You get some... Uh, 1360 clear drops you also get six blue six green so that's basically a free a free two characters almost two characters i1 and you also get 35k and 30k sharper and dust uh, for 10 euros for 14 euros ish i think it's 15 no i think it's 18 euros 18 euros for the initial summon package it gives you 20 pulls for 18 euros you get 20 pulls so like 70 cents per 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 pull something like that on the offer of the month of course these resets once every 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 month and this every week right because it's uh wait actually initial summon is uh is once at a time for the month one and the others here like uh, collection of the ne uh, Nels uh, Memento of under the moon those are probably just one but I, did, I believe there is an let's say autumn offer stuff like that we're gonna have some uh current ones for us as well they're gonna change with the seasons right so the initial summon package 18 euros gives you 10 20 pulls the offer of the month is i think 24 ish 
it gives you 20 pulls as well so that's uh that's like a little a little less of efficient but it's another free 20 pulls it's a little bit more i think it's like 20 23 euros 23 dollars something something like that and this is like all the stuff you get something for free at level 30 you get these for free at level 30 which is good but those are the first the, the best two those are the best then we have the garment shop on the garment shop you can buy uh, skins for your favorite characters keep in mind that if you're just a monthly monthly uh, pass user monthly pass buyer in three months you will be able to afford one skin of your choice uh, that, that is like rerunning here for free because you get 300 every month so you're gonna need three three months to get 900 and be able to buy a free skin free skin uh, but on the long term it's gonna be nice to keep that in mind because if you don't convert them and if you just keep them here you will be able to buy a skin and on the pawn shop, this is where you exchange your materials that you get by doing dailies and weeklies. Uh, those are the weeklies ones. And on the weekly one, you can get free temples by paying the, the cassette. You get the cassette by doing the weekly. And I believe you get the, the golden cassette by getting by pulling. You get pull, you do the pulls and you yeah, you use those to buy extra pulls, or if you amass enough of them you can actually buy copies of characters this is a six star so it's 2.4 uh, 240 this is um necrologist is a uh, is a five star so it's a little bit cheaper so you can even get some extra free six stars if you don't use them just so if you pull a lot or even if you don't over time you will have enough cassettes to buy a free six star so the, these like rotate so now it's voyager and necrologist but it might be different, so keep an eye on it. And if you have enough, or if you want to save for it, you can wait until the, the character comes that you want. So that's going to be a free character that you don't have to worry about after you get it. So you can maybe skip an entire banner and an entire patch, which is equals a lot of uh, a lot of crystal drop save, a lot of pull save for the next patch, just because that way you had enough to buy a free a free six star, and it was the one that you wanted. So keep keep an eye on this one. It's going to be really nice on the long term. This is basically just a fragment shop and this is not spending stuff, right? So the wilderness shop, you can buy stuff and you can buy extra pieces of your wilderness. They, they follow different themes and depending on the current patch, you have different themes of the, uh, for the, your wilderness. So if you want to make this theme over here, you can just buy it for 1.1 uh, crystal drops, 1.1 K crystal drops and you also get these uh, conches by uh, completing stuff in the wilderness. So it's going to give you a lot of conches that you can use to buy. I believe this is an option. You can either buy it for free with the conches or pay crystal drops. Let's see. Yeah, you can choose to buy it with, with, the, with these conches. I don't know if they're conches or this, whatever this is or the crystal drops you can just buy everything or just buy the singular pieces if you just need a couple right and this changes compared like depending on the the current patch so in the next patch we're gonna have on the 1.4 patch we're gonna have a new wilderness pack and it's gonna be a greek themed so it's gonna, you're gonna you're gonna have like temples and cool stuff like that on the pro puddle of rain this is where the the, spend, the biggest spending appears, and this is the classic, like, you spend, this is probably $100, $100 if I had to guess. Or maybe 150 It might be 150 I don't know. It's, it's probably, like, 100 150 50 25 10 one something like that. And there is always, of course, on the first spending, you get double. So if you pay this, you're going to get 15k. Uh, you know. 13k, <clears throat> 13 point, no, 12.960, 12.960, okay, so, going back, these are the best, basically, Roaring Month, Rookie Shopping Day, that's it, if you're a low spender or like just, a, you just want to tap it a little bit to get a little boost, get the Roaring Month and the Shopping Day is going to be five, five dollars and you get both, you get free character, a little bit, you get a, um, one pool, 10k, 10k, free bunny, and then you get 3k 
crystal drops 2.7k if you don't if you don't use those to maybe you want to save them for skin it's going to be 2.7k crystal drops and 1.8k free stamina every day well not every day and in a month but it's 60 every day and then if you want to spend a little bit more you, you're like a medium spender let's say you can buy the rookie offer you can buy the so initial summer package you can buy offer of the month those are basically uh with like with like fifty dollars, you can buy everything that I've stated so far. So far, you're gonna end up with uh, a lot of stuff, including instant, instant, forty pulls, instant. Just by buying these two, these two packs, it's forty pulls. So, and with this one, with the rookie offer, you're gonna instantly boost one character to I one. Actually, maybe almost two characters to I one. Just not I2 because I2 needs the purple ones and you don't have uh, probably day one you won't be able to either either go to the stage that drops the, the purple one or convert the blue one into purple one on day one, right? So on day one you're gonna have 40 pulls and probably instant do one uh, one or two characters I1. So I think that's it. There is nothing else that I can tell you more than this. Uh, it looks really nice and it's really, I feel like it's a little more generous than other games, let's say Honkai Star Rail, because the, the Rory Month even gives you the stamina refill, while, for example, Star Rail doesn't do that. Uh, PGR doesn't do that. So, this is really, really good. I really like this. If we if we have this on the, on the global, I'm assuming it's going to be exactly the same. You can also buy the battle pass that I can't unfortunately show you because my the battle pass in the Chinese version it's over so it's uh, temporarily disabled. I'm gonna have to wait until 1.4 to show you in game. So, but it doesn't really matter. It's just the usual battle pass, and you just can you can do the normal free to play line, or if you can, you can do the deluxe deluxe edition, which is uh, 10 euros, or the collector edition, which is like 13, 14 more or less, and the normal edition, the deluxe edition, which is the first paid option which is the ten dollar one is gonna give you around 1.260 thousand crystal drops on top of all the materials and a free skin it in this case in this in this pick is gonna be matilda but i don't know if it's always matilda so it might be different depending on which on the battle pass i actually i'm pretty I'm pretty sure it is uh, on the collector edition, it gives you 10 levels, and on top of that, you also can you also get more stamina and 400 extra crystal drops. So it's going to be instead of 1.2, it's going to be 1.6. So this is another option that you can uh, you can that you have if you want to spend money on the game. So, uh, but this is not extremely worth it. But so depending on what your priorities are, you might not want to get the battle pass, or at least maybe get the battle pass once or twice every time like maybe in some months you want to buy it, some months you want to skip it depending on what you want to how much you want to spend and what you want to buy or what materials you might need right so the pricing is that the options are these so i think that's it guys thank you for watching if you have anything to say leave a comment if you like the video leave a like if you want to see more videos about reverse 1999 consider subscribing because that's basically what helps me the most i feel like so thank you for watching and see you next time